All right, so uh, another real leather video. <clears throat> I have a few on the board coming up soon. Ones I've been working on. Uh, a couple of custom, actually three custom spinners. This is the first one. Rated R spinner. A uh, customer wanted to go with a red die. Um, and this is the same red dye, it's actually a water stain that I used for the, uh, the red universal, uh, but I just applied more coats so that it comes in more, uh, much darker. It's, I don't know how well it's coming across. It's one of those things, if you take it outside, it's like a fire engine red. If it's inside, it's a darker red, so it's hard to tell how it's coming through on camera. That's a reflection there. But yeah. And we've got some custom tooling snap box there that logo kind of belts jmar style jmar stamp a good example of a belt that initially i'm not huge fan of just the, the spinner in general but when you put it on red leather i don't know pops i think it looks cool Finish burnishing the edges so there's a little bit of leather debris there. No, it's nothing that's not permanent. Rated R. Other end. Sorry, camera's in the way. Yeah. Standard black backing, nothing surprising there. Yeah, let's, uh, <clears throat> I actually like the red a lot better than the, uh, than the black, the stock strap. Um, just, I, you know, I just think it pops more. I'm a big fan of different sort of colored belts as opposed to the standard black. I got a bunch of them in my own collection. Anyway, yeah. That is a re-leather of a rated R spinner with custom tooling. Thanks everybody for watching.